everyone welcome back to my channel uh, so tonight I made a crock pot Tuscan garlic chicken with spinach and sun-dried tomatoes anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and um, use my recipe planner this is a recipe that I don't want to forget so let's go ahead and get started uh, so today I'm going to use the farmhouse sticker book um, I'm not sure how much of this food book I'll use um, maybe and then colorful boxes if I need it. That's what I think I have so far. Um, I'll also be using my uh, HP sprocket. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Move some of this out of the way. Um, this is actually supposed to be a crock pot meal, but I decided just to do it on the stove and do it just a, a little bit different than what how they had it. So I'm just gonna put it under my main dishes. There's a new recipe book that came out that's so cute. I'm tempted to get it, but I'm not going to because this is a great book also. They have these long little strips in here that you can use. I'm looking for one of those. Little banner. All right, here we go. I think I'm going to use this. So the next thing I'll do is fill out the ingredients. directions first oh and you know what just as a side note I thought at first so I was doing you know using this recipe book for like original recipes this recipe book can just be used for you know any recipe that you might find I like to keep recipes that um, things that I make that are delicious that I know it's a family favorite I'll put it in this book because I know they'll want to come back to it picture because I want to make sure I have enough space. The sprocket this is an HP sprocket it's quite small I really do like it I think the pictures come out good quality there on the back so on the back you just peel this off you can just lay it where you want to 
lay it where you need to. So, this chicken, oh, y'all, so good. So the last thing that you do, you add in the spinach and then season to taste. This serves for um, main ingredient is chicken. Spinach difficulty, make it a two. Prep time, I'm gonna say, I think that took me about 35 minutes. 35 to 40 minutes. Oh, that's it, cook time and prep time. I'll leave it there, temperature notes. I have no notes, but down here is to serve with. I'm gonna add another box. Add another black box. We ate it tonight with wild rice, so you can serve it with rice, any type of rice. You can serve it with pasta. And they have on here that you can serve it with like zucchini noodles. I think that's pretty cool. Okay, more zucchini noodles. Put it right here. I like to put the website, the name of the website. So it's eatwell101.com. So if I ever have to go back to it. So I'm just gonna go through this um, farmhouse book and see what else I might want to decorate this with. I like this, this is more of this. Like, yes, please. This is more of this, please. I'm gonna add a couple of arrows. Uh, <laughs> I'll put this little chicken up here. We'll sign this is dinner. See if I want anything else. I think I want to keep it. I'm pretty sure just like this. I thought I wanted to add some more. I thought this was beautiful. A couple of places. Add a little bit right there. Make sure I don't see anything else. Yeah, so this was what I had for dinner tonight. I'm so excited about how it turned out. Taste amazing. So even if you get a chance to uh, fix this meal, go for it. Tuscan garlic chicken. Um, and once again, the website is right here, eatwell101.com. So make sure you uh, check it out. So once again, thank you so much for joining me. Please subscribe, like, and click the notification bells. Remember, think happy, be happy.